Good morning, everybody. This uh, video is a summary of what we did today in the training, especially for our international teams that are registered in Colorant and in this drill, especially Canadian and Indian teams. So we're just going to do a summary where we talk about just to verify some of the rules, just to be sure we are on the same page. So let me show you first a couple of things. We're gonna start with coloring uh, in the Spanish version of the of this summary. I started with uh, this drill. I'm gonna start with coloring this one because I have it ready. Just to show you a couple of things, okay? One of the things is that we already did the the uh, we already assigned which uh, which are the two numbers, the two squares that you have to go to. We already did that, that ruffle. And uh, you're gonna do be doing number two and number three. You can go in whatever order you want, okay? If you consider it's easier to go to three and then to two, you can do it, it's really up to you. Okay, that being said, that, be, that being said, uh, I'm just gonna show you something. Let's say, for example, I have this programming, okay? Uh, I'm gonna uh, make uh, an example with number one, with square number one. If my robot only partially touches the square, it's not valid. I don't have a way to know if it's only part of the robot that is on top of everything is on top, okay? Like this doesn't work. I mean, it has to be all the robot on top of the number. Now, let's say for example, I have this. I'm gonna do it again. Uh, remember it's two and three, I'm just uh, giving you an example with number one. This, does this work? Yes, even though there's a little tiny bar in white, it's mostly in the square, so that one applies. That one is correct. This example, yes, it applies, it's covering everything. So those are the two valid ones. The first one is not valid, just to let you know. Remember that this one, for this one, you cannot have any uh, anything loaded, preloaded in the, in the software itself. You have to actually do everything from scratch. The blocks start, start, start. Can you do it for me? It's doable. Yes, it's doable. Last time, just to let you know, coloring was sold in 35 seconds. That's programming and executing the, the actual program. It was a different map. Uh, my prediction is less than two minutes in this time and probably less than one minute. So what I recommend is to start the team straight to start with that two minute mark and start, you know, working on that program, do it better, better and faster until you can hopefully be less than one minute. That's that's uh, something you can do. So that's our uh, information for the coloring. Now, remember coloring is maximum four minutes uh, that you have to solve uh, everything, right? But it's very likely that the winners are gonna be around one minute, less than two minutes, uh, that's for sure, two minutes or less. Okay, now, what are we gonna do right now? Just gonna go ahead and show you what we did. If I can have it. Okay. This is what we did in the um, this drill. Just to show you what we did with the this drill. With the this drill, pretty much what I did is I defined some um, custom blocks just for you to know how to do it. For example, this custom block called a puerta, which is the, like the door, right? And let me just rewrite that for you so I can put a, a, a name that you understand. Accept, that's fine. Uh, I have to erase this first. So how do I do it? I go to blocks, I'm gonna create, I'm gonna put it like entrance. That's how it's gonna be called, entrance. And what is entrance? If I know all the blocks have to be 200 millimeters, this is 
in, in coloring is 250 okay just to let you know in case i didn't mention and here is 200 millimeters one two three and a half because it has to be here so i'm gonna do that the entrance i'm gonna advance let me just put everything in in in, in english i apologize show it in spanish in the other one but is the same thing right okay that entrance is going to drive forward 700 so if i put that is going to the entrance where are the blocks where are the blocks i don't see my blocks oh here they are no my blocks what happened here entrance okay Oh, there you go. Now I have it. Okay, entrance. And what is going to happen is going to advance 700. Now I did something called P1. What is P1 going to do? It's going to pick up this drill. So I tell him to to the left, advance, boost the magnet, and come back and return to that position. So if I do that, Look how easy, I just don't have to copy and duplicate blocks, I just drag in, right? Okay, and then to go back home, I just put going in reverse, instead of what we did in entrance, going in reverse, but it's the same thing, and it comes back. Now, what is this for? These custom blocks are gonna allow you to do a way faster coding, okay? That's it. That's all we said that was a little bit different that maybe you didn't know. To record this video, this drill, we recommend Loom. We recommend uh, to do um, a Camtasia, a screencast. Loom is the one I recommend the most. It's easier. It's a, it's a plugin for uh, Chrome. It's easy to use. It's on, on the cloud. It's in the cloud. You don't have to deal with all these recording and uploading. And that's going to take time. Okay. That's it. I think that was very straightforward. Uh, for the University of Calgary teams and robotics battalion teams, if you need anything, uh, please let me know. Okay? Sounds good. Bye-bye. That was everything, and remember to send me a message.